Presentation profiles can save you a lot of time. We're going to edit this particular presentation. We're going to go all the way across to the presentation tab. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to decide what I want and what I don't want in my presentation. So I'm going to just deselect a couple of things that I may or may not want in my presentation. And then I'm going to go to my pages. And I'm going to add a page or two that I may want. So I'm going to add one of my pages and maybe I want to add a website statistic. I'm going to go to my selected. I'm going to drag these to the appropriate place where I believe they should be in my presentation. Scroll up to the top, and you'll see here a, a blank presentation profile. I'm going to click on Create. I'm going to name this profile. And I'm going to say My Seller Presentation. And I'm going to add 01 at the end because maybe. I'll have more than one seller presentation that I like to use. And that's it. It's saved. I'm going to go back and I'm going to show you that the default, all the things that we took out are now back in. All the things that we put in are gone. And I'm going to go back to the one I just saved. And there it is. Everything that I want in a standard presentation is saved. So when you start a new presentation from scratch, all you have to do is select one of your profiles and it will automatically update to the preferences that you like. And just save the profile again and don't forget to save the document as well.